So L and Cher would have been sorority sisters, but L doesn't like Cher, but Cher desperately wants to be L. I'll explain. If you've never seen Clueless, it's about a 15-year-old girl who thinks her new friend is ugly, so she gives her a makeover, and then she realizes no amount of makeovers can clean the inside of your soul. If you've never seen Legally Blonde, it's about a beautiful blonde woman who becomes independently successful while realizing her ex-boyfriend ain't shit. And that's all you need to know. So let's start with the obvious. Both Reese Witherspoon, who plays Elle, and Alicia Silverstone, who plays Cher, were both born in 1976, making them the same age. But if that's not enough for you, Cher was a freshman in high school in 1995, or what we're assuming is a freshman because she was 15. Legally Blonde came out in 2001. Now, the fact that she was able to attend Harvard the semester, like after she decided she was going to Harvard, um, that would probably make her a college senior. So given the time frames, they are either the same age or they are within like that four year graduation period where they could have been in college at the same time. Furthermore, they are both affluent women from the L.A. area, and I don't believe they would leave California to go to college except when Elle went to Harvard for law school. But prior to that, she didn't really seem like she wanted to leave. They did not, however, go to the same high school. Elle went to Pacific Preparatory High. And Cher went to school in Encino. So here's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking there may have been a high school rivalry, or even if there wasn't, uh, Cher absolutely would have heard about Elle. Or when Cher gets to see ULA and she joins the sorority and she sees Elle as like the sorority president, she already decided she's going to model herself off of her. And watching Elle succeed in getting into law school, that's really going to drive her to do something she wants to do. I don't think it's going to be law school herself, but it's definitely going to be something. Elle, on the other hand, I don't think like Cher. Elle would find Cher to be kind of a snob because if you look at Cher's like whole demographic thing, she has that very hierarchy of popularity and beauty thing going on, as opposed to Elle, who is friends with everybody regardless. Elle, on the other hand, is a real one. She is friends with everybody regardless unless you give her a reason not to be. She never has a bad thing to say about anybody unless you are giving shit to her first. Even when she was getting that manicure with Jennifer Coolidge and she was trying to find something bad to say about Warner's girlfriend, but all she could come up with was like, oh, she needs highlights. Like, that's not even really an insult. In conclusion, I have pretty much proven the point that these two absolutely know each other in movie universe. That doesn't mean they like each other. What happened to Miss Independent? Do 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 do. It's Elle Woods and Cher.